Hello everyone, in this video, let us take a look at uh, how to enable block feature in uh, Confluence. Now, I have made few videos on Confluence and uh, not many because uh, Confluence as compared to Jira is not that complicated. It is a very simple tool to use, but still I think it requires some understanding. So today I want to answer this question. So someone is asking about how can I enable block feature in the sidebar and uh, this user Andre Kalai is asking about I thought the block feature would automatically allow writing and sending blog post but when I click on it it takes me to a blank site space and there is or there are no options for writing a blog post so let us see how it, how it looks like I'll open my my confluence and let me open one of my space now the first thing that you will notice is that when you open a new space it has some template or you know some some recommendation about uh, what all you can do if you click on let us say blog it will there is nothing here right there is no option here to uh, write a blog but that is not how you do it you basically need to go to the button on top create so when you click on create button on top you can select in this space I mean you can obviously select any space you want but let us say you want to talk about Blog, uh, this particular space the name of the space is new space you can then uh, select the blog post and this is nothing but these are nothing but uh, different templates blog post is of course one such uh, template if you click on it it will let you write a blog post but block blocks in confluence they are slightly different if you notice uh, they follow this uh, you know breadcrumb kind of a navigation on top you can write your, your blog post like hello world and you can write content here like this is my blog when you publish it it will then be displayed if you if you take a look at the blog uh, blog here let us refresh this and uh, let us take a look at uh, the blog again so it will appear here basically so whenever you write keep whenever you, whenever you add a new blog post it will appear here under the current year which is 2020 and uh, even if you go back uh, to your uh, main page you still have the link but if you want to if you're wondering how to enable it you can maybe then click on if you have a new space it is usually enabled by default but if you go to the go to the uh, uh, space settings and uh, then if you take a look at uh, let me uh, click on overview first I'm a bit lost so sidebar configuration yeah so that was uh, the tab I was looking for uh, so you can define here choose what appears in your sidebar so you can uh, just use this toggle now if you refresh it now let us see what happens uh, or maybe I'll click on the overview and uh, see how it looks like so when you click on the overview now uh, you still have that blog in your uh, space but the navigation is now uh, no longer there because that was actually coming from if you click on this uh, hello world hello world is the blog that I just added uh, but that option to basically click on blog and then take a look at the blog with of course the navigation was there because of that particular toggle so it is something that you can take a look at if you want uh, if you want to enable it I think it is, a, it is a good idea but if if the question is how to enable it it is usually there for you if you even if you create a new uh, space for example if you want to let us say uh, create a new space for a specific project or maybe for a specific uh, uh, purpose for example let us say you create a blank space nothing nothing in that particular space so let us see if I want to name it as uh, maybe my team updates let us let us use that let us use something like marketing uh, space and uh, if you click on the create button so I'm creating a new space for you just to show you how it looks like like 
brand new space you have this blog option for you by default and uh, when you click on the create button you now have the option to start writing a blog post and that is how you will uh, use and you can and you can you can use start using uh, blogs and as i mentioned before blogs are nothing but i mean blog is also one of the template and you can always create your own template in confluence so i hope you so i hope you learned something new today and you enjoyed watching this video thank you very much